Sage Gold Inc. is a mineral exploration company involved in all aspects of exploration, development, and financing of projects in Ontario, Nevada, and Arizona. Managed by financial and geological specialists with extensive experience, Sage Gold is actively exploring, developing, and acquiring properties. With a liquid stock and ambitious year ahead, Sage Gold seeks to become a strong player in the precious metals market. My name is Nigel Lees and I'm the President and CEO of Sage Gold. Over the past four years, we've acquired exciting projects in North America, both precious metals and base metals. We have a highly qualified team of technical and financial personnel who've had experience in developing and putting mines into production. In 2008, we have a very exciting exploration program, which is primarily drilling in Ontario, Nevada, and Arizona. Our neighbor Kodiak has discovered a major new gold occurrence, which they refer to as the Golden Mile. The Golden Mile trends northwest towards the Jacobus property, and the magnetic signature of the Golden Mile is similar to the magnetic signature on the eastern part of Jacobus. We are currently trenching, stripping and channel sampling quartz veins that we have found uh, on that eastern side of Jacobus. The Ottoman project is located north of the Jacobus project in the Beermore Geraldton Gold Camp. Uh, the mineralization is characterized by volcanogenic massive sulfide mineralization with copper, silver and gold, also base metals, lead and zinc. We've also recently announced that we discovered visible gold on surface in quartz veins on the Ottoman project. Uh, we are drilling both the VMS targets and the gold targets. In Nevada, we plan to drill Pony Spur. Uh, we completed one hole into Pony Spur in the fall. We ran out of season. Uh, we plan to continue that program. We have other projects in Nevada that we're looking at as other potential drill targets for this coming season. Gold Hill is a very interesting project in Arizona. The mine last produced in the late 19th century and has never been touched since. There's never been a drill hole on Gold Hill. There's never been modern uh, geological techniques applied to Gold Hill. Uh, initial impression when we, we do a gold evaluation is if, if the old timers did a significant amount of work, there's something here, there's, there's something, there's, 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 there had to have been value here. If, if, if early 1850 they were coming in here, uh, mining in a very crude manner, then even pre-dynamite, uh, the, the values it must have been high grade, and the gold must have been relatively recoverable by crude method, by crude crushing methods. Um, so we're we take that into consideration in in, in the mine evaluation. Um, right here is the first the first exposure of our of the fault controlling the vein structure we're working on. That vein right there is. Yeah, that's that's a pretty good exposure of the of the high lime, high limonite material there. The, the uh, like right here is a, an ore chute, so they developed ore uh, directly above us, and it was dropped down through here and loaded into ore cars. So they were able to actually um, uh, from this level here. They also went down on the structure, and so there's more workings below us here, which uh, which goes down to considerable depths here. And what, what's, the, what's the depth, uh, Nick, on this? We go roughly 165, 170 feet. You can make certain assumptions in that the grade, the grade must have been pretty good to, to have brought the ore out that way. Um. Yeah, our, <coughs> our, our mining crew, they've actually walked around in the, in the, in the stope, and the shape of the stope is, is uh, in, in their description, is like a football. So we, that, that seems to tell us that the, that, uh, the zone can widen out and uh, there can be dilation. So, in this, so uh, and, and that means that, that you could have large, larger tonnages that are, that are concentrated on, on, on intersecting structures. Our hope is that there would be an, an, another ore zone similar to this one along strike on the structure and we do have indication of that on surface. So, um, again, that's, that's where what, what our, what our drilling will be targeting are these additional uh, ore zones that we believe are a long strike on the structure here. We have a very exciting exploration program ahead of us. The Beardmore Geraton Gold Camp is going to be extremely active. Properties in Nevada are in major gold producing areas. Gold Hill may be a great surprise. The outlook for commodities is very bullish 
and our stock is very actively traded. Sage Gold Inc. trades under the symbol of SGX on the Toronto Venture Exchange.